This week, CDC Conservation Center welcomed a pair of African painted dogs at Entebbe International Airport in Uganda. The pair, a Southern African subspecies, arrived around 10 a.m. in the morning and was immediately driven to the Conservation Center in Butambala District, where they were released and fed a healthy meal. Thomas Price, the director, broke the exciting news while speaking on the Jonathan Benaya podcast on Wednesday. Well, yeah, uh, I'm very happy to say that after uh, six months of preparations, we this morning finally imported our first two African painted dogs, which used to be known as the African hunting dog. Uh, we imported this pair from South Africa and they're currently the only African painted dogs in Uganda that we're aware of. Uh, yeah, um, we just received them, so we just gave them a snack. Uh, they both got one big chicken each and they <laughs> munched it down right away. So we're, we're happy that they're already getting used to the place and, and showing a good appetite. And uh, the name Painted Dog comes from the colors. They're, they actually look like somebody painted them. They're brown, black and white, uh, spotted with a very nice pattern. Uh, with a snow white tail very very beautiful colors actually so uh, yeah we're very very excited because uh, these dogs have not been in Uganda for quite some time and it's nice to be able to help restore the environment even in small steps at a time Also called African hunting dogs and previously referred to as African wild dogs this species of wildlife has for long not been seen in Uganda there are rumors that some individuals might have been sighted in northeastern Uganda, around and within Pian Ope Wildlife Reserve, as well as Kidepo Valley National Park in recent times. However, several recent searches failed to find any substantial evidence to substantiate these claims. Some scientists say the few reports could be of migratory groups from neighboring South Sudan or from within parts of western Kenya. Holly Olive Akello, who works as a wildlife handler at CDC Conservation Center and also doubles as the facility's general manager, was elated about the news. Today is one of the best days at CTC Conservation Center. Adding the endangered African painted dogs to the facility is a sign that conservation in Uganda is taking on the right direction. The African painted dogs that most of us have just been watching on internet, are finally here. The facility which breeds other species of wildlife like lions, reptiles, hyenas and small cats is open to the idea of collaborating with organizations like Uganda Wildlife Authority and other related wildlife conservation bodies along lines of research, education and where possible reintroducing some of these lost species back in the wild. We have some big plans where we're looking at cheetahs and black rhinos uh, maybe over a time span of a year or two or three depending on how things continue with COVID and everything like that. We had quite a lengthy discussion on the podcast, so be sure to listen to that episode for more details. <laughs>